Inside the shadow of Geneva, under the world's floor, lies a shock of human creativity and a normal harbinger of decimation. The Large Hadron Collider, LHC. It is a manual of insightful evaluation, permitting specialists to examine the subatomic at large and impelling the disclosure of the puzzling god particle, the Higgs boson. As of now, eminent physicist Brian Cox has made a chilling declaration that sent shockwaves throughout the religious community. Something significant has been researched at CERN, something that might have accomplished expanded ways beyond our comprehension. Has our essential objective for edifying instructive assortment set us on a crash course with disaster, obliging us as we plunge into the pit of this clear problem? Yet, sooner than we jump into the assertion data, what sizable particle accelerator pedals the immense LHC, worked by utilizing CERN? It is a 17-meter ring of superconducting magnets and the field's most important and generally preposterous solid atom crush. It represents the zenith of human scientific achievement. The truth of the situation is so solid that it can replicate the genuine conditions of the universe's creation. Should this construction intend to open the insider assessments of the universe, it remains mindful of the way to something clearly more significant, possibly disruptive. CERN, laid out in 1954, is one of the world's most critical scientific research associations, with 23 member states and a vast array of specialists. It is a central hub for joint effort and development. The LHC is CERN's focal undertaking, but it's just one part of a huge network of accelerators and detectors. This includes the LHC, which is designed for subatomic particles and is dedicated to the study of existence itself. The LHC speeds up protons to nearly the speed of light, sending them on a collision course that mirrors the energy of the universe at the time of the Big Bang. The effects create temperatures one million times hotter than the center of the sun. A colossal array of magnets guides the protons on their path while advanced cooling systems maintain the magnets at temperatures colder than space. These include 1,232 dipole magnets that steer the beams and 92 quadrupole magnets that focus the beams. Before collision, another type of magnet is used to compress the particles together to enhance the likelihood of collisions. The task of CERN is to collide particles with such precision that they meet accurately. The precision required is astounding. The LHC's design is a marvel of engineering, with components packed extremely close together, with alignment precision measured to within 574 feet. The entire system is cooled to a temperature of 46 degrees Fahrenheit, colder than the vacuum of space itself. This cool environment is essential for the superconducting magnets to work optimally. The LHC's detectors are positioned at four locations around the accelerator ring, corresponding to the locations of four major particle experiments, ATLAS, CMS, LHCB, and ALICE. Each has a specific role in investigating unique aspects of particle physics. Collectively, these detectors capture immense quantities of data from particle collisions. Specialists then sift through this data for evidence of the elusive Higgs boson, also known as the God particle a rare anomaly that holds clues to the universe's fundamental structure. It's akin to working on an endless jigsaw puzzle, where the pieces are invisible and the picture is difficult to discern. By focusing on the microcosm, we gain pieces of knowledge about the universe. Yet with each discovery comes new questions and challenges. The LHC is not only a remarkable scientific instrument, it is a symbol of human curiosity, progress, and the quest to understand the fundamental forces of the universe. However, as we stretch the boundaries of our knowledge, we must also consider the moral and existential questions that arise. What are the risks of probing the unknown? Should our quest for excellence unexpectedly unleash forces we cannot control? Inside the sacred halls of CERN, where the frontiers of human understanding are continually pushed, a recent revelation has sent shivers down the spines of even the most seasoned scientists. Brian Cox, a former CERN researcher and a prominent voice in particle physics, has made a statement that has left the scientific community both captivated and alarmed. Cox's remarks reflect a daunting possibility. The LHC's goal is to recreate a miniature Big Bang, an event that initially formed our universe. The physicist also discussed the potential implications of this objective highlighting the LHC's capability to uncover new dimensions of understanding, including insights into dark matter. 
a substance that constitutes a significant portion of the universe. Contemplating the possibility of glimpsing the true nature of the universe is an alluring opportunity, but one fraught with danger. The idea of recreating a Big Bang is not merely theoretical. It involves real conditions that replicate the universe's infancy. With such power comes genuine responsibility and the need for careful consideration of potential risks. Consider the situation where something goes wrong. In 1978, Russian physicist Anatoly Borsik experienced an accident that could have altered his life. While working at a high-energy physics lab in Russia, a proton beam accidentally passed through his skull, entering through the back of his head and exiting through his nose. Despite this catastrophic event, Borsik survived and continued his work, although he suffered from some severe health issues. This incident is not just an anecdote but a cautionary tale illustrating the immense energy and potential dangers associated with particle accelerators. The risks of particle accelerators like the LHC are not to be taken lightly. The potential for extraordinary reactions and the manipulation of fundamental truths require meticulous safety protocols. Among the most concerning possibilities is the creation of miniature black holes, regions of space where gravity is so intense that not even light can escape. These hypothetical entities could have unforeseen consequences if they were to grow uncontrollably. Despite extensive safety measures, the possibility of creating a black hole or other exotic phenomena cannot be completely ruled out. Theoretical models suggest that any black holes produced would evaporate quickly, posing no threat to Earth or its inhabitants. Nonetheless, the very notion of potentially generating forces beyond our control remains unsettling. As scientists push the boundaries of our understanding with the LHC, it is crucial to do so with a thorough awareness of the associated risks and uncertainties. The pursuit of knowledge involves navigating these potential dangers with transparency and public engagement. The Large Hadron Collider, with its extraordinary capabilities and potential for groundbreaking discoveries, stands as a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless quest for understanding. However, Beneath its impressive exterior lies a domain of profound scientific inquiry, replete with potential hazards and ethical considerations. The experiments conducted within the collider involve energies and forces beyond the grasp of most people. The impact of subatomic particles at near-light speeds replicates conditions present in the universe's earliest moments, allowing researchers to explore fundamental aspects of matter and the very fabric of space-time. While these investigations offer immense potential for discovery, they also carry significant risks, both known and unknown. Ultimately, as we continue to explore the mysteries of the universe through the LHC, it is essential to balance our pursuit of knowledge with a deep awareness of the potential consequences and a commitment to rigorous safety practices. 1. Background on CERN and its research CERN is a leading research center for particle physics. Its flagship facility is the Large Hadron Collider, LHC, the world's most powerful particle accelerator. The LHC smashes protons and other particles together at near-light speeds, allowing scientists to probe the fundamental components of matter. 2. Nature of Unexpected Discoveries Unexpected discoveries in particle physics could involve new particles or phenomena, finding particles that were not predicted by the standard model of particle physics. For example, anomalies in the data could suggest new particles or interactions, unexpected behavior of known particles, observations that don't align with existing theories, which could hint at new physics beyond the standard model, such as supersymmetry or dark matter. Anomalies in data. Unexpected results might also come from unusual patterns or measurements that challenge current understanding. Three. Brian Cox's contribution. Brian Cox, known for his ability to explain complex scientific concepts in a relatable manner, would likely contextualize the discoveries, explain what these new findings mean in the broader context of physics. How do these discoveries fit into our current understanding of the universe? Discuss implications. Elaborate on how these findings could influence future research. This might include changes to theoretical models or the design of future experiments. Engage the public. Use clear, engaging language and analogies to make these discoveries accessible to a general audience. 4. Examples of past discoveries. 
to give a sense of the kind of unexpected discoveries that might be discussed. Here are a few historical examples. Higgs boson, the Higgs boson discovered in 2012, was a key piece of the standard model. Its discovery was a significant surprise and confirmed the existence of the Higgs field, which gives particles mass. Antimatter. The discovery of antimatter and the behavior of particles like positrons, the antimatter equivalent of electrons, have led to significant advances in understanding the symmetry of the universe. Neutrino oscillations. Observations of neutrino oscillations, where neutrinos change type, provided evidence that neutrinos have mass, which was not included in the original standard model. 5. Impact on future research. Unexpected discoveries often lead to new theoretical models. These might propose new particles or forces that could explain the anomalies. Further experiments. Additional experiments may be designed to explore the new findings more deeply potentially at different facilities or with new technology. Cross-disciplinary insights. Discoveries may also impact other fields, such as cosmology, material science, or even technology development. In summary, the latest from CERN, Brian Cox discusses the unexpected discoveries likely refers to a discussion of new and surprising findings from CERN's research, with Brian Cox providing expert insight and explanations to help the public understand the significance and potential impact of these discoveries on our knowledge of the universe. Potential Areas of Discovery Given CERN's scope, unexpected discoveries could come from various areas, new physics beyond the standard model. Discoveries that challenge or extend the standard model might include finding evidence for dark matter, extra dimensions, or new fundamental forces. For example, the potential discovery of a particle that could be a candidate for dark matter, like a WIMP, weakly interacting massive particle, would have significant implications. Rare particle interactions. Observations of rare or unusual interactions between particles can reveal new physics. For instance, the study of rare decays or interactions might show discrepancies from theoretical predictions, hinting at new physics. Quantum gravity and string theory. High-energy collisions might provide insights into theories of quantum gravity or string theory. These theories attempt to unify gravity with the other fundamental forces, which is a major goal in theoretical physics. 7. The Role of Media and Communication Brian Cox's role is crucial in translating these complex findings into more digestible formats. Media appearances and public lectures Cox often appears on TV, radio, and in public talks to share exciting scientific developments, making sure that the general public can follow along with cutting-edge research. Educational content. He might produce educational content, such as documentaries, online lectures, or books, to help audiences understand the implications of new discoveries. Public engagement. Through public lectures and discussions, Cox helps demystify science and foster greater public interest and understanding of physics. Eight. Broader implications of discoveries. Unexpected findings at CERN can have wide-ranging impacts. Technological advancements. The technology developed for high-energy physics experiments often leads to advancements in other fields. For example, the World Wide Web was originally developed at CERN to facilitate collaboration among physicists. Philosophical and conceptual shifts. Major discoveries can influence our philosophical understanding of the universe. For instance, finding evidence for a multiverse or radically new forms of matter could change our perspective on existence and the nature of reality. Collaborative science. CERN's discoveries often involve collaboration with scientists worldwide, leading to international partnerships and advancements in science and technology. 9. Future prospects. Looking ahead, CERN is planning upgrades and new projects that may lead to further unexpected discoveries. High Luminosity LHC An upgrade to the LHC is aimed at increasing its luminosity, allowing more collisions and thus more data, which could lead to the discovery of rare phenomena. Future Colliders Plans for future colliders, such as the Future Circular Collider, FCC, are in development. These new facilities could explore even higher energies and more fundamental questions. Quantum Computing and Data Analysis Advances in quantum computing might revolutionize the analysis of the massive amounts of data generated by experiments at CERN.